hi back again and I have finished the scooty finally just finished it hot off the well sewing hook I guess so it is short I didn't get the whole 96 oh wow it could almost pass for Yenta I didn't get the whole 96 inches um, this is all I have left of my James C. Brett Marble Chunky. And this is the first time that I've ever, of course, finished something like this. So I wasn't quite sure how to do the sewing, even though I wrote, read the instructions. And um, so I didn't know how much of this I would need to connect. So anyway, it's done. It's going to be very warm, and I downloaded or I bought the basket weave, and um, I'm going to buy uh, some more of the uh, Marble Chunky. I think I'm going to do the Flamingo, because my mother likes, um, she likes pastels, pinks, that type, so I was thinking of making another one. In fact, I had showed her this one when it wasn't finished and she oohed and odd and oh this is something that I really need and uh, you know Christmas is coming up and it really didn't take too long to finish and uh, I might do that so my next project is of course finishing up my sock I've got my first one done I'm, I showed you this is how far I am on my second this is the cup of course for me. So, yeah, I've got like maybe two more inches to sew before I start the heel flap. Now, and of course, I, I, I showed you guys this. This was my first sock. And I'm not sure what this bubble is. This, this like bubble. But I did do the, I did make the mistake and I, I purled here and I shouldn't have purled. I don't know why I did that. Maybe that's why that is. I don't know, but I'm hoping that the second sock won't do that. I guess I'm showing you the, it looks pretty, actually I did not find the heel to be too terribly hard. I did drop a couple stitches, of course, they're in due to the mistakes, but all in all, it didn't, it wasn't very hard. I was expecting, I don't know what I was expecting, but I wasn't expecting that. But the um, second one's well on its way. I have started a, I have some old, old, old um, yarn. Had for over 20 years, and it's acrylic. So I, starting the 10 stitch, 10 stitch blanket. And I'm going to use up my all my old yarn with it. And it's going to be like a, you know, when I don't want to do anything else, you know, and I don't want to start anything, then I might do that. So, so I don't really consider, it is a work in process, but um, I really don't want to get more, because I had, I have three things. I had three things going. I had the blanket, I had the socks, and I had the scooty. And I was starting to feel a bit overwhelmed. It's like, you have to stop. And plus I came across this pattern that I had downloaded from. I had seen uh, one of Stacy Perry's uh, Very Pink Knits. Uh, she did a, she did a um, video. It's the Entrelock. It's free, so I don't think I'm going to get in any trouble. Anyway, Christmas, like I said, Christmas is coming up. And I really think that this yarn here, this unforgettable boutique in the sunrise colorway, I think that that would be a nice thing for my daughter-in-law. So I'm going to watch it again and see what I can do with that. Plus. I have a my black and white boutique 
that I was going to, I don't think this is sock. I don't think this is fingering sock. It takes five millimeter needle, needles, US three. Maybe it is. I don't know. Maybe it'll be a, a, a really thin, but anyway. I think my daughter would look nice in that with the black and white. So I don't know. Plus, I have some beautiful dove gray. But I only bought one skein. Like a, I was so mad at myself every time I look at it because it's not enough, I don't think, to do anything. Not even a hat. Ooh. Oops. It's, it's so soft and it's so beautiful and it's so small. This was one hank. I should have bought two and there was two there, but I was trying to be cheap about it and I wasn't quite sure what I wanted to make with it. But I had this awesome, I want to make that uh, either this Downton, Downton inspired hat which I think would be really awesome with this color. I'm going to need more. I'm going to need two. Anyway, so I'm going back down, excuse me, I'm going back down to um, Holmes County where, where I got that yarn. So I'm going to stop in the same place again. I'm going to actually take a snippet of or I just might take the ball so I don't have to cut any off because Lord knows there's not a lot in there to cut. And then see if they have another one there for me that I can buy. And then I'll definitely get started on that hat. There are so many wonderful patterns on Ravelry and such that it's, it's, the mind boggles as to what to start next. Um, I do still have the... Uh, two up socks but um, book from the library but I haven't finished this sock yet which I'm going to definitely concentrate on um, concentrate on now that I have a squiddy done and uh, I have to wait till payday so until I can get some more um, some more James C. Brett to start another squiddy for my mother so that's about it um, it's very cold here in Ohio um, fall has seemed to decide it's going to make an appearance. And, uh, don't get me wrong, I don't mind. I don't really like hot weather. And uh, you'll usually find me whining about sweating and such. So it can take the cool weather. So anyway, I just wanted to show my, my finished project. And I hope everyone has um, a great weekend. And... I don't know what I'm going to do with this. So, bye.